Hello. Hello. My name is Anastasia. I'm from Ukraine. Ukraine. Today we eat sukiyaki, which is like Japanese beef, vegetables with raw eggs. Mm -hmm. uh, I've heard a lot about uh, sukiyaki, oh. but uh, today I have the first chance to try. All right, let's go. Let's go. So today I have ordered Kobe beef and Japanese beef mix. So you can compare standard beef and like Kobe beef. Yes. So you say like this is your first time to try sukiyaki, but why haven't you tried it before? Do you have any reason? <laughs> I tried uh, something similar, yeah. like nabe, oh. but sukiyaki is a little bit different and also like I go yakinipo often, oh, okay. but sukiyaki and usually in all these places which I can't read kanji, I don't go. Oh, I see. So those that I read, I go, but those that I cannot read, I don't go. <laughs> Appetizers. Okay, so inside we have some leaves, cucumber and green onion. Yeah. Do you have this kind of dressing for salad in no. Ukraine? No, I don't know what is that. <laughs> <laughs> also, maybe I can find in the supermarket. Yeah. Um, but actually in, Jap in Ukraine, uh, Japanese restaurant is not Japanese, are not Japanese restaurants. Like they serve California rolls there. Yeah. It's not. And like sometimes they have sushi. But it's usually like rice and fish, so no one ordered. Oh. So no one knows that in rice, also like wasabi and like some like soy sauce. Yeah, yeah. Like it's so complicated sushi. But in Ukraine, just rice and fish. Mm -hmm. That's why like ah oh, sushi, I want to order like a roll, and everyone don't understand the taste. And like people come here, like Ukrainians, they don't want to eat sushi because ah oh, sushi is just rice and no, it's not just rice. Oh, I see. This week I've been to like sushi. But it's so, you know, komakai, like everything is so detailed. Oh, yeah, yeah. And also, appetizers in sushi, you know, it's something like an art. Oh. Not like French, but still. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's comparing to Ukraine, it's much different. Do Japanese usually eat sukiyaki? Um, yeah. For not lunch? often, but it's not like everyday meal. Oh, really? Yeah. Why? Yeah, especially in the winter time, mm -hmm. it's good to eat, you know, warm up. Party. Mm. I think in Ukraine there are so many soups and cities like with yeah, soup, but right? all year round. All year round, yeah, yeah. This is Wagyu. So, when was the last time you came back? Mm. One year, three months. Oh, okay. I just miss my family, not, not food. <laughs> food. You can still find like some uh, traditional restaurants uh, here. Yeah, but I think Japanese food or like some another food is more healthy. Okay. Japanese food more like high quality and more natural. Ukrainian food more with spices, not so much spices, but a rich taste. Uh, also meat, like chicken is same, but like beef. No, we don't eat usual beef, but in Japan much better. And of course fish. Fish you don't have so much fish. Yeah. Just like salmon, salmon tuna, and some maybe. tuna no. No tuna. <laughs> we have tuna, but yeah. it's so expensive. Uh, well, Kansai food Kanto food you to Kanto nan this kid mata toten original de gozai mashte. あの、I think it's a nice quality. And also, uh, if possible, I would add some rice or it will be a perfect matching. <laughs> How about like egg and beef? Does it match? Well? Yes, of course. Oh, okay. Actually, most of uh, European people don't eat 
like X with meat, especially raw one because it's dangerous. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But in Japan, you have a chance to try it. So you start eating raw eggs in Japan with rice. It's so tasty with rice. <laughs> oh really? <laughs>
food was amazing, especially Kuba beef. Yeah. I would like to try Skeki again. Yeah, yeah. Are so. you full? <laughs> yeah, I'm so full. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye.